I recently got a smart ring that uses AI to talk to you. Check this out. Hey Luna, can you please tell me what you can do for me? Hello, I'm here to help with anything related to health, fitness, nutrition, and wellness. Whether you want tips on exercises, nutritional advice, ways to stay motivated, or maintaining a balanced lifestyle, feel free to ask. How can I assist you today? This is the Luna Ring. It's a unique health smart ring that I've been using and testing for about two weeks. It has the ability to automatically begin tracking your activity, sleep monitoring and health monitoring among many other things that it can do. Quick disclaimer, Luna did provide this smart ring for me to be able to test out and at the same time they sponsored this video, but they provided no talking points for the video. They just want me to share my personal experience and how this ring has been for me during my time that I've been using it. When you order the ring, the first thing you get is the Luna sizing kit that comes with different ring sizes that you can test to find the perfect size for you. And this box has instructions to tell you how you can discover your ring size. After you confirm your ring size, this is the box that the Luna ring comes in. You can see here how it opens and right here it has a pretty colorful box that you can lift up and it will reveal the Luna ring. The ring just lifts up just like this from its charger and bringing it closer you can see how this ring looks. I like that it has three different sensors that you can see inside and the sensors don't actually protrude inside too much so it's almost flush with the body so when you are wearing it it actually isn't biting into your skin unlike some other smart rings that I've tested. The ring color that I chose for myself is the rose gold color but this ring comes in multiple other different colors that you can choose choose from such as the star that silver sunlit gold you have the lunar black rose gold which is my color and you have the midnight black in the box of course you also get the ring charger which has a USB-C connection point at the bottom and then if you pull this pull tab right here there's an accessory package that has a quick setup guide that you can see right here you also get another thank you card for choosing Luna and you get a USB-C to USB-C cable to set up and begin using the ring you can download the Luna ring application and once you open it the setup process is pretty much straightforward although I have to mention that for me I had a failed attempt two times when I was initiating the ring but after that it worked good and I was also happy to receive a software update over the air that resolved some of the issues that I was experiencing. The first thing you're going to see upon opening is that this ring has multiple different tabs that you can see right there and the home page is going to show you the date right there today and you are going to see your ring status right there so you can see my ring is 100% charged and it was synced about 20 minutes ago and you can see more information about your ring. If you go back you can actually choose the different dates right here to see how your metrics were and I like that this ring has the ability to automatically detect certain activities including nap detection. So I did take a nap before I started recording this video and you can see it automatically detected this and I'll just confirm it right there. And now the nap has been added and well done, my score has been improved. And if I want to know more, I can click on the no more info tab and as you can see here, it's gonna give me important information such as my heart rate, my heart rate variability and my temperature right there. The home tab has more important information. So you can see here, it gives you a score of the different parameters that you can see such as your activity and it's gonna compare and tell you where whether it's up or down compared to like yesterday, you can see my activities have been basically going downhill because I, I'm, I'm, I haven't been that active at all. So you can see the steps that I did. And if I continue down, you can see to get the ideal sleep, there's a sleep planner page right there and I can set an alarm from this page. And there's Luna AI, which we'll talk about later on, but you can also see important sleep information right there. So here the nap has been added and now you can see my sleep score that I have. It's actually doing pretty well. And under this section, you'll be able to see your respiratory rate, your RHV, your SpO2, RV, and temperature. And it will show you your time in bed, night movements, among others. So there's a lot of parameters that you can see in all these sections. You can see my readiness score. And 
right here you can see how to monitor the different important parameters that it gives you if there's one that requires attention or you need to look into for example you can see my skin temperature is about 0.27 degrees celsius higher than average and if i click there i can find out what it is or how much i was averaging and see if I know what was going on to help me improve my health. Now, if I continue down as well, there is like stress levels that you can see and it's gonna tell you if you are relaxed, focused or stressed. And this heart rate that you can see as well among sleep scores that you can see. Now, as you can tell from the homepage, this is more of a brief overview of the different parameters that this spring looks at and if you want to go into more details you can actually select that section right there or you can select it from here for example for sleep you can see my sleep score and my sleep duration in the activity section i like that this ring gives you a graph to tell you how you are performing over time and it's going to tell you to pay attention if you need to improve on certain things and you can see here it's going to tell you the different movements and how long you've been active and if you want to actually um, measure certain workouts you can add workouts or record workouts from here and you can see the different workouts that you can choose from you have walking running yoga treadmill bicycle and many others that you can choose from most of these if you actually just wear your ring and begin working out it's automatically going to detect and then start measuring your metrics but if you want to manually initiate workout from here you have the ability to do that one of the things that sets this ring apart from most of the other rings out there is the lunar ai that it has this section basically has a daily health digest that you can click on to view your averages and a quick summary and what it pertains so you can see on this screen it has different slides that are telling me about my different parameters and i can find more important information about it if i wanted to cancel this and begin setting a workout plan i have the ability to do that set up digest plan or how do i improve my readiness score if you want to do that so you have preset prompts that you can use to ask the lunar ai but it has this microphone that you can click on and begin to talk to it. How can I improve my sleep? Improving your sleep often involves establishing a consistent sleep schedule, creating a relaxing bedtime routine, and ensuring your sleep environment is comfortable and dark. Regular physical activity and reducing caffeine or electronic device use before bed can also help. It's all about building habits that promote relaxation and quality rest. If you're using the Lunar Ring, monitoring your sleep patterns through its app can provide insights to further enhance your sleep quality. Just like that, you can see how easy and straightforward it is to get important information on your health, sleep, or activity among other health parameters just using this Lunar AI. I have no diet restrictions and I'm fairly active, but can you help me lose weight? Absolutely. Since you're already fairly active, you could consider incorporating a mix of cardio and strength training into your routine. Cardio exercises like brisk walking, cycling, or jogging can help improve your cardiovascular endurance, while strength training exercises like weightlifting, bodyweight squats, and push-ups can help build muscle and boost metabolism. You can also focus on increasing the intensity or duration of your current workouts gradually over time to continue challenging your body. How do you feel about these options? I think those options are great. An amazing advantage that this ring has with its AI capabilities is that because you are most of the times going to be wearing your ring, it can tailor make specific workouts, specific diets, or even sleep schedules. For example, I asked this ring to build a weekly workout plan for me. I just had to answer a couple of questions so that it's custom and works best for me. And after I sent in those prompts, you can see the Lunar AI was able to create a weekly plan and it's pretty cool that it also gave me the option to add this workout plan to my weekly routine so if i go to my calendar section in the lunar ai portion i can be able to see the different days of the weeks and the weekly workouts that i have this is pretty unique and it works for workouts as you can see it works for sleep it works for diet and 
is something that can help you save time or stay focused on your weekly goals or things that you want to achieve with your health. The lunar ring is supposed to get you about seven days of battery life, but since I'm more of a hardcore user and I've been testing the different facets and functions that it can do, I'm always, you know, fascinated by seeing the sensors come on and I like to compare the metrics that I get with my Apple Watch Ultra and most of the times the metrics I get are pretty close in range. So the battery life that I've been getting for me before I have to connect it to a charger is about six days, which is pretty good. And at the same time if you're worried about your ring getting water damage it's actually waterproof up to 50 meters deep which is pretty good while the ring has this line that you see right there to help you know where to line it up with this mark on the charger i found it at times very difficult for me to be able to find the perfect position to get it to charge but after lunar support reached out i found that it's actually pretty easy and you just have to find the right side if this side is not working then you might want to try the other side because it fits in pretty good without trying Trying to force it and then it will begin doing the breathing but in from my personal preferences i feel like this design can be improved but after some time you do get the hang of it at the time of recording this lunar ring is actually going for 300 dollars before any discounts and from my personal experience since i've been testing it for a while now i really feel like this ring is worth it for the price it's one of the first smart rings that i've seen and tested to find that it has useful AI features. Even though it's still improving by day, it's much better than my other smart rings that I have that don't have the AI implementation. And it's UI is simple and intuitive to use. So if you're interested in the Lunar Ring, I'll leave links to it in the description of this video that you can check out and take your health game to the next level using the Lunar Ring. My name is Ben. I'll catch you guys in the next video.